An effort to get drivers to slow down on a busy Kaneohe street and stop them from using it as a shortcut is causing confusion, and some residents say they weren't even told about it. Jen Boniza has more. Jen? Joe, the goal is to make our roadways safer, but residents say the new roundabouts in the Keapuka community are making things worse. Traffic calming circles are meant to slow cars down, but the partially completed roundabouts on Ahia Road and Luluku Road in Kaneohe have residents frustrated. It just doesn't make sense. And, and actually, it causes more traffic. And um, so when the cars are going down and there's a car coming around, like it's there, should we let them go or not go? You know, so it's kind of, it, it doesn't make any sense. So nobody really knows how it works. Right, exactly, exactly. They don't know how it works, exactly. I even saw several cars and a city dump truck going through it. Residents are also concerned about the safety of the roundabout because it's black. They say it's difficult to see it at night. Pereira tells me she found out they were putting it in from this sign. I met with City Council Member Ikaika Anderson. He says talks about the project go back to 2010, and the project was approved in 2016. He estimated cost for the roundabouts and a road repaving project in the area is $10.6 million. It could take almost a year to complete. But how does it work? The vehicle that's entering the circle on the right has the right of way. And any vehicle already in the circle should be permitted to exit the circle before any other vehicles get in that vehicle's way. Anderson admits there may be a learning curve, but... The goal is to cut down the speed and at the same time to discourage folks from cutting through the community. It's doing that. A city spokesperson tells me that pavement markings and signage along Luluku Road and Anoy Road leading into the roundabouts still need to be completed. Joe. Thanks, Jen.